Welcome to our comparison video on switching from 245 70ths R16 to 265 70ths R16. The diameter difference between these tire sizes is 3.7%, which slightly exceeds the acceptable 3% range. This means the interchange is not recommended without considering potential adaptations. You might need to consider modifications like leveling or lift kits to accommodate the larger size and prevent issues like rubbing. Switching to the 265 70ths increases the diameter by 1.1 inches, which in turn raises the vehicle's ground clearance. This increase could improve your vehicle's ability to navigate obstacles and rough terrain, making it potentially better suited for off-road driving. The 265 70ths tire is 0.79 inches wider, expanding from 9.65 to 10.43 inches. This wider profile increases the contact patch, potentially improving traction and stability, especially in off-road conditions. However, it may also result in increased rolling resistance and slightly reduced fuel efficiency. The sidewall height increases by 0.55 inches with the 265 70ths. The taller sidewall could provide better impact absorption and a more comfortable ride, especially on rough terrain. However, it might also lead to slightly less responsive handling on paved roads. With the larger 265 70ths tires, the speedometer will read slightly lower than the actual speed. For example, at a speedometer reading of 20 miles per hour, the actual speed will be 20.75 miles per hour. Based on our observation, switching to 265 70ths R16 offers benefits such as increased ground clearance, potentially improved off road performance, and better impact absorption due to the taller sidewall. The wider profile may also provide better traction and stability in various driving conditions. However, there are some shortcomings to consider. The larger size exceeds the recommended 3% diameter difference, which could affect vehicle dynamics and may require additional modifications. The wider tires might result in slightly reduced fuel efficiency due to increased rolling resistance.